This speaker was sitting on my shelf for months. I had no idea what I was missing. This is the Neon from a company called Travel Wi-Fi Audio. I'd never heard of them before, but I can't wait to see what they do next. Everything about this speaker is just a little bit different, starting with the lighting mode. LEDs? There are 10 color and pattern variations to choose from, or off. Let's start with the familiar. There's the power button, and that's about where similarities with other speakers end. Well, maybe not quite. There is the lighting mode selection as well. Beneath this plug, we have the USB-C charging port and a three and a half millimeter auxiliary input. When there is a plug over the ports like this, it usually means it's at least water resistant, if not waterproof. This is IPX5 water resistant. You can splash it, you can spill things on it, you can have this in light rain, it won't hurt it, but do not submerse the speaker. The speaker is designed to sit on its end like this, or you can hang it from the lanyard. Have you ever seen a volume adjustment like this? It is a roller. If you keep on rolling and rolling and rolling and rolling, eventually you wrap around to the other side. So you can turn it up all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way, and then it suddenly plummets to volume zero. <laughs> so it's kind of, it's, it's just, I like things that are different, and this is definitely different. The top of the speaker is a touch control. If you tap it once in the center, it will play or pause. If you tap it twice on either side, you will either go to the previous track or go to the next track. Just, it's kind of something you have to get used to, but again, anything that's this different just makes it more interesting. There is a 2000 milliamp hour battery in here, and they say that will give you about eight hours of playback. However, those measurements are normally taken at 50% volume, and I predict you will want to turn this up much louder than that. You can turn this up to about 80% volume before you get distortion, and I think you will because it sounds really good. This has bass for days, especially if you set this near a wall and let acoustics take over, you're, this, you'll love it. It's pounding bass. It sounds great across the entire audio spectrum. This is what speakers should be. I'm just, I'm just blown away that I haven't heard of these guys before. I don't have many specs for this speaker. They say it's 24 watts of power. I think that means dual 12 watt speakers, but it, I guess it doesn't matter. It just sounds fantastic and it, it's plenty loud. Don't worry about that. 24 watts is loud. It's kind of a hidden feature, but there are three EQ presets, vocal boost, bass boost, and flat. If you are the kind of person who cares about the hands-free operation of your cell phone, this has got you covered. It sounds excellent. It sounds as good as just using the phone by itself. Different isn't always better. Different isn't always innovative, but I love this speaker. It sounds so good. And I can't wait to see what else Travel Wi-Fi Audio has in store because if this is my first impression, what's next? That's five out of five for me. Thanks for stopping by.